We want to graph the solution set for the system of inequalities. Because all the inequalities contain the equal sign, that means they'll be solid lines. And we graph each of them first as an equality. If I start with the first equation and look for my intercepts, if y is 0, x is 3. And if x is 0, y is 9. So I'll draw a straight line through those points. If I wanted to test to see which side to shade, I could test the origin as my test point, And I'd have 0 plus 0 is less than or equal to 9. That says I'm going to shade this line in this direction. For the next equation, if y is 0, x would be 3. And if x is 0, y would be 2. So I can draw my line through those two points. And then again, for a test point, I could test 0, 0. I'd have 0 plus 0 is greater than or equal to 6. That's not true. So that says don't shade the way that this 0 is. Shade in the other direction. Now, finally, I want x to be greater than or equal to 0. So that means shade to the right of the x-axis. And y is greater than or equal to 0 means shade above the x-axis for y, and I need to figure out where all these overlap. Well, this line shades to the left, so my solution has to be to the left of that line. This side shades up, so it has to be above that line. It has to be above the x-axis and to the right of the y-axis, and that gives me the only place where all four of those overlap is in this triangular region here. So that triangular region is my solution.